Well, a year ago, they said they had no plans to shut any ticket offices. They said that in the, in the uh, Transport Select Committee, and now they're closing all of them. So I don't believe anything that the train operators say because they do what the government tells them. And the worst thing anyone in this country could do is believe what this government is telling them. There will be no regulations about staffing our stations and they will quickly move to a position mm. where the majority of our stations are unstaffed for the majority of the time. We've already seen that in the documents that we've been given today. And they're not protecting the staff. They have issued a statutory redundancy notices. In one company, it's up to 60% of the staff. Wow. In other companies, 31%. Another one, 24%. So this is a fig leaf for a drastic attack on staffing levels, and it will make our railway dehumanised. It will make it a dangerous and forbidding experience for many people, especially those that need assistance. And there will be no assistance there at the times it's needed. And that will mean people can't travel, and they'll be more locked up in their houses. The elderly will have to rely on apps and call centres and all this kind of stuff, which is of no use to you when you want to make a, a quick journey and have that turn up and go uh, access.